What's up, everybody? Today we're talking about Netflix Ultimatum South Africa. Ooh, and if you have seen it, then you know and you know. So we're talking about ultimatums once again. Get ready. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of You Heard What I Said. We here once again with my brother, Keon. What's going on? Hello. Hello, Precious. <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing? I'm good. What's up? I just had a, I just had a sip, so I feel it. It kind of hit me real quick. Ooh, okay, so, okay. Well, look, so let, we could cheers early because I could take me another one. So, look, I know we early, y'all, but get y'all drinks ready and come on and toast with us for another episode. Cheers. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yep, I needed that right there. Yeah, that's, that, that's going to help get the... Get the episode going. <laughs> getting, the, getting, the, getting the lungs kind of, you know, right, kinda yeah, nourished. <laughs> exactly. Like like the Tin Man need a little, little oil. 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 Right. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, that's what he. That's what he. That's what it was like though. Like, oil. Yeah, but okay, I wasn't expecting his... you to do it though. Hey, dude, <laughs> working on my acting skills. <laughs> Okay, I'm not mad at it. <laughs> yeah, you, you like it? It didn't. No, no. Nipsey Russell, it, shout out to you. Rest in peace, Nipsey. It, it was good. <laughs> oh, <laughs> all right. It was good, just not expected. <laughs> oh my goodness! So yeah, I'll, I'll sing his song. I can. I know the words to his song too. Uh oh. Ah, some oil to me. That's all you remember. It's a little slide. Oh my god. And for those of you, I'm talking about the movie The Wiz. Not The Wizard of Oz. (laughs) The Wiz. Right. Gotta know the difference. Gotta know the difference. (laughs) Well, look, I I, um, didn't necessarily get outside, but it was the grandbaby's uh, birthday. So we we did a nice little celebration. uh, So that was cool. You know, family came by. But that was my weekend. What about you? That was a a fast two years, man. (laughs) Who you telling? Well, Oh, okay. I don't know if you're going to say the opposite. No, you know? no, I, I yeah, agree. Okay. Yeah, no, I agree. Mm-hmm. Man, two years. We were, ta- what were we, we were talking about, oh, you know how we had got the cats, right? Mm-hmm. And um, these new cats, well, they're not new anymore, but we got them when they were pretty much just born. Mm-hmm. And it seemed like we got them yesterday, and I was just told that we, we've had them for like three or four years already. Like, oh, yeah. Okay. For real? But, Yeah. It's wow. been a while. Time goes by fast, but I'm I'm good. Uh, first week in a long time that I, I saw him, uh, my oldest more than once in a week. Oh, um, yeah. I mean, of course, they all it was all situations uh, with the vehicle. Uh, okay. you know, we get notifications, and it was a low. T- no, we I, we got I got like four new tires recently on, mm-hmm. them. and um, for, for some reason, there's nails in the tire like every couple months, and. Uh, so I went back and I'm like, dude, are we, did we get the cheap tires? And he looked mm-hmm. and was like, no, nah, dude, was like, y'all got some some good some good, some good tires. Right. But for that reason, you know, so he came over and we went to get it replaced. And mm-hmm. uh, thankfully this time, I mean, I got the warranty, whatever, because last time mm-hmm. it was on the the far inside where it couldn't be repairable. Oh, so we okay. get a new tire, but it was free because I got the little warranty type deal. Right. But this time it was in the middle, uh, so they were able to patch it up. So I saw him that mm-hmm. day. And then yesterday, or I, uh, this morning, mm-hmm. I'm asleep, you know. I'm, I'm trying to sleep, like, you know, like, make sure my chin's up like this, so, this, so I can t- t- help with the, the snoring part. So, you know, you know, all, and all of a sudden, ring, 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 ring. And I, you know, I, remember, I don't know if you remember, I told you, I'm, I'm a, a deep sleeper, but light sleeper. I hear everything mm-hmm. that goes on. So, all of a sudden, mm-hmm. the phone's ringing. I'm like... Wait a minute. Right. With the sleep, right? It's not a, I, you know, I'm like, I didn't just, it's not the middle of the day where I took a nap. So I look, it was like 3 30 in the morning. And I'm like, oh, shoot. Oh, God. Uh, oh, God. That's the worst. Yeah, right. So, but I was so tired. I, I didn't even think the worst. Mm-hmm. But I was, you know, I was like, hello. And, and mm-hmm. uh, it was like, hey, we're on our way up. <laughs> and I'm like, dude, like, it's like 8 o'clock in the morning. Uh, oh. <laughs> you know, he, not the way he was sounding, like, yeah. it was bright and early, but it was right. 3.30 in mm. the morning. And he was like, hey, we're on our way. 
it, it's okay we stay over you know for the night the water's out Ooh. and so i was like all right cool you know he was like you know, i don't have my keys so uh you know what do you want me to do i was like you know we got the the notification and stuff so i was like just come mm-hmm. i'll let you in so you know right. they come over and um i guess they're they're working on the they're they're working on the pipes in the in the parking mm-hmm. lot or whatever and i, and I guess mm-hmm. they burst something and so the water was mm-hmm. out and uh yeah so they came over and um I, I can get, get back to sleep to about 4.30, 5 o'clock. Yeah, I know, and, right? And, uh, yeah, and I woke up a few hours later with him tapping on the door. Hey, we're about to leave, you know. And uh, so they left. And then this is also a day where uh, my wife's uh, good friend, you know, she I don't know if you remember, she moved to Cali. And um, there was some furniture that she left back for mm-hmm. us to give to him. Mm-hmm. And so we uh, rented a truck and, and uh, took that over there. So I saw him again later on this afternoon. So it was good, and man, it was. Remember, I told you, I don't know a long time ago we talked about trucks, right? You know, like mm-hmm. you know, it's a lot of people in the high trucks, whatever they feel like they own the roads and everything like that. That's kind of like how I felt today. I was in a van, and I was sitting, I was sitting up in the in the van, like you know, I kind of had that. <laughs> that, that <feeling. laughs> anyway, so it was, it was an interesting twenty four hours, but uh, besides yeah. that. Not not much. Just kind of getting ready for you, dog. To right, start right. Like that. So we going through some some little minor repair, this and that, and the other. You know, getting everything ready for y'all to 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 come visit. So well, you and had you a busy day. Yeah, it's, it's been busy. Busy, busy day. I'm trying not to think about this uh, flight because you know me and flying. But I'm like, I'm I'm be cool. I'm. Be good. <laughs> okay, just breathe. What is it? Breathe in for a second, <laughs> hold it for four, and then breathe out for two. Just do that. You know that doesn't like uh, calm me. That doesn't. No, it'd be like I gotta catch my breath now. <laughs> like <laughs> no. <laughs> so yeah, I I don't know, but no, I'm I'm gonna be good. I'm trying not to think about it, so that way I can. Calm myself and prepare. So. Think about it this way too. <clears throat> it's nonstop. Yeah, right. Because yeah. I feel like yeah. a lot of times I don't like the you know the the layovers or whatever you call, mm-hmm. they call it where you go up down the up down again. That's, yeah. that's I'm just like, come on, dude, I just pay the extra you know whatever it takes, just straight shot there. Right. I don't like I don't like the the the. Well, I'm good. I don't want to. Yeah, I love no, I love I'm, flying. I'm fine once I get up there. It's just the pressure of like when you they speed up and then you go up and it's like you like <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That that's the only part that uh that bothers me. But besides that, I'm fine. So, so do you like know. a window seat or aisle seat? Uh typically it's usually three of us that go at a time. This time it's just two of us. So when it's the three of us, I'm usually in the middle. So uh and I'm okay there. So it it really uh it does it doesn't matter to me. So, it, it doesn't matter where I sit. As long as I got enough space so I can sit up and be like, Okay. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> so yeah, nah, I'll be fine. I I'm gonna make sure I Ooh, I have me a, a drink beforehand. Hey so, now now you remember them drinks hit you hard in the air with the elevation. So I'll just letting you know. So if you have a drink I mean, it won't hit you like, oh my God, like, you know, but like mm-hmm. one drink is kind of like having two. You, well, you, I yeah. usually drink before I get on, so I don't drink oh. on the plane. Okay. I have something yeah. before, so that way I'm like relaxed when okay. I get there. Yeah, so I'm gonna drink before I leave the house and then I'm gonna give me another drink at the airport, but not while I'm on there. So by that time, yeah. it, it would have been in my system. I remember having a drink at first class, man. It was so much fun. <laughs> I wish yeah, I yeah, was. Yeah, give me another. You know, I, I was scared to ask for like more because I didn't want to yeah. feel like a lush, you know, like, you know, but. No, nah, you take man. advantage of that. I wish I was one of the ones where I could just go straight to sleep as soon as I get on there and then I could just bypass the whole thing, but it's fine. It's cool. But, You'll be all right. You'll yeah, all right. I'm, I'm going to be good. I'm going to be good. Usually I would have been a little anxious by now, but I'm, I'm good. I'm good. So. So let's get into it, because last week we talked about ultimatums and if we were, you know, if, it, if we thought it was OK to give them. Uh, so and we got this topic based off on I was watching Netflix 
and there was a Netflix ultimatum South Africa. And when I started watching, I was like, oh my goodness, <laughs> like, what's going on with y'all? And so now we here to talk about it. Cause man, yeah. <laughs> there were a couple of couples that was like, woof. Like how, yeah. how did y'all make it this far? <laughs> it's crazy because there were six couples, mm -hmm. but of course it kind of turned into 12 couples. And I, you know, I'm like, right, hey, yeah. Up. It was, yeah. man. I, I mean, I'm like, okay, you look the same. You look the same. Wait a minute, no, okay, you know. So I'm yeah, because two of the girls That's do kind of look alike. A little bit, yeah. yeah. And I've kind of noticed the difference, but I still don't. You know, it's like there's a lot. Like you said, there's a lot of stuff going on. A lot of mm -hmm. I don't say baggage, but a lot of a lot of issues and a lot of everything. But I appreciate you bringing it out to me to watch it because it was it was it was good. It was interesting. It was. It was. And uh, it, and uh, you know, there was some not some wise words being spoken. Uh, in in there as well from from uh, a few of the um, a few of the few of the guys, few of the girls. There was some 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 nice words of wisdom being spoken and yeah. and uh, I know so. Genesis. Uh, he's you know uh, he was definitely giving out some words of wisdom. I was like, oh okay, Genesis, like uh, we hear you. <laughs> so that that was nice because he seemed like such 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 a sweet guy it was like oh so yeah i was definitely uh team genesis do you want to do you want to tell for those that have never seen it you want to maybe say what it was about and and talk about maybe do you, do you um, have a list of the, the name of the couples i do have the name of the couples uh pretty much the ultimatum show was uh Couples who had been together for as short as six months, you know, all the way to a few years. Um, and one party wanted, was ready for marriage and the other party was a little hesitant. So they said, okay, look, I'm bringing you to this show. And after this six week experiment where you kind of like break up in a sense, you do like a trial marriage with uh, another person for three weeks and then you go back to your original partner to see if anything has changed, you know. Uh, and then you decide like, do I want to, the person who was given the, ulti uh, given the ultimatum, do I actually want to propose? Do I want to accept the proposal? Do I want to be with somebody else who I was doing the trial marriage with or do I just want to walk away? you know, on my own and, and do my own thing. So it was pretty cool. But yeah, I, I don't have the laptop kind of in front of me. I'm going to put it down in my uh, lap. But yeah, there were so if you you guys see me looking down, that's because uh, I'm looking at my my notes. But the one couple was uh, Ruth and Isaac and Ruth. She was like unapologetically her. She like, I'm doing my thing like because I wanted to. <laughs> Yeah, I'll only apologize if I feel that I did something wrong. You know, I'm, that part. I ain't, do, I ain't do nothing wrong. So I'm not gonna apologize for nothing. Yeah. That part. Yeah. She, she was something. And then there was uh, Lebo and Nola. Oh, Lebo and Nola. Oh my goodness. And then there was Tabby and Genesis, Courtney and Aiden. Um, Kanya and Nadeko and uh, I don't, oh gosh okay forgive me because I know I'm gonna pronounce her name wrong uh, I know they called her SZA but I think it's like SZA, oh, I don't want to I don't want to pronounce it wrong so we just gonna SZA's go with good, SZA they, yeah. Yeah, they all they all you know that's how she went by right yeah um, there's SZA and uh, Lindale so. Uh, yeah, they they were uh, something. So I guess we could we could start off with like Courtney and Aiden. Um, Courtney, she's the one who issued the ultimatum, and I know their main thing was more about communication. You know, like she was a little uh, slow to open up. He, from what I heard, a little. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> she did. She a definitely little. took yeah. <laughs> And she was paired with Genesis, right? For the trial marriage. And I'm like, you, isn't that who she was with? I'm like, you got the sweetest guy, you know, there. And they both yeah. were like, well, she was like, I wish I had opened up sooner because, you know, I could have gotten a little bit more out of the experience. But in a 
with um with Aiden, I know there was an issue, like I said, with communication as well as I believe his finances. And I I know I think her parents, when the parents had met up, they were like, Okay, you need to get a job. So I'm assuming that was like the finance part that he wasn't, right, right, you know, yeah. working. Or <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah, or in between. Guys. Yeah, but ultimately, because probably because of the people who they were paired with, they were like, "Yeah, we're we're good. <laughs> we go make yeah, this had, work." <laughs> yeah, because I don't know. I just had a feeling that I don't know if any. I don't know if they paired with anybody that they would have been with. Yeah, that, or, you know, I don't think they, anybody would pique their interest. Yeah, cause I think that they were already set because because mm-hmm. um, uh, Aiden to me was really cool yeah. really laid yeah. back mm-hmm. it seemed like that he I'm, I'm trying to talk like a little bit yeah. where he would think before mm-hmm. he spoke mm-hmm. because mm-hmm. his words were coming out really slow <laughs> and so I think that he thought his stuff first <laughs> and then the words came out afterwards so he was very I would say and not analytical he was very you know he picked he picked his words well mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. you know so he yeah he was kind of like in the middle of some of the situations, kind of like trying to diffuse things. So, uh, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. but they he ended the mediator, up mediator, yeah. right? Yes, he was the yeah. mediator. Mm-hmm. But he ended up proposing to Courtney, uh, and then she ended up giving him a ring as well. And oh, cool. came yeah. out of her shoe, didn't it? Or something? Right. <laughs> yeah. Like, damn, you go, Courtney. Right, because like, she was damn. like, you didn't do what I was gonna do. <laughs> So, I mean, I don't think it's anything wrong going after uh, what you want. So, yeah, and then I think the reunion, uh, they're doing well. I don't think anybody was married as of yet. There was one oh, couple so that didn't have reunion? a surprise. Yeah, you didn't see the reunion yet? Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I, know, I know how far you went. Cause, you know, yeah, I no, know. right. I saw the okay. whole thing. There was only one couple that was like, uh, oh, you know, that's a shocker. But uh, nobody had gotten married, but uh, there's Correct. still a, a couple and they were doing well. So uh, shout out to uh, Courtney and yeah. Aiden. And he got a job, y'all. So yeah, and he got some, a job. Some, <laughs> yeah, some marketing something job, but uh, he got a job, y'all. So, right. So they're good. Uh, they're good. And they look good. They look good together, you know. Because like, the reunion was a year later. Mm-hmm. Uh, and so they, you know, they, they, they look good, look happy. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, not much, not much drama between those two. It was, right. it was pretty kind of, kind of basic. Like, hey, let's, let's try it out. But uh, you know, I, I'm good. You know. Yeah. Now, since uh, Courtney's partner, she was matched with Genesis. We could talk about Tabby and Genesis. And Tabby's the one who gave the ultimatum as well. And uh, he just wasn't ready because he didn't think that he had enough money, you know, with all the traditions, you know, uh, that they have. You know, he was like, you know, I need to be able to present this and do this. And, you know, yeah, yeah he just Definitely wasn't. Definitely different th- <clears throat> in Africa than, than the States. Yeah, they guess. Absolutely. Like, big difference. Absolutely. Uh, and as far as Genesis trial marriage, it's not like he got to experience too much you know like I said he was just too busy trying to be the mediator so I'm not sure right. exactly what he necessarily learned you know to like grow and to bring into his relationship but uh Tappy I mean you know she had her uh, uh, a good time you know with her uh, trial husband because wait who was Tappy with Tappy was with Linda Lay? is that who Tappy was with yeah, I got pictures over here. I'm trying to. I don't have the names, but uh, yeah, I, yeah, I think so. Yeah, I believe Tappy was with Linda Lay, um, and because they're the ones who it was like a possibility of them like walking away and be like, oh, we we might. Because are they the ones who gave each other a gift after the three weeks? It was pretty hectic. Yeah. Yeah, it was like yeah. you come back to the room as you now back with your you know partner and it's like just gifts laying on the bed and stuff it's like what the heck <laughs> and that's where that's where yeah, and that's where tabby's uh original partner was just like man you're doing stuff that i didn't do you know and it was, mm-hmm. i guess it was kind of a wake-up call because uh he, he you know no disrespect to to him but he was just like man i need to treat my my girl better 
Right. Yeah. Ab- absolutely. Absolutely. So, and then with the Linda Lay, Linda Lay and SZA, uh, I'm not sure who gave the ultimatum with them, but I know they were. No, I think he gave the ultimatum. Yeah, I believe he gave the ultimatum. But they were only together for like six months before they came on the show. And that's why she was like, well, I'm not ready yet. Like, we just got, you know, together. It's only been six months. And he's like, well, you know, you know. Like, (laughs) I know and and I'm ready for this. And I mean, the good part about them is even though they were only uh, dating, you know, for the six months, I'm I'm not sure for how long... beforehand but they were friends first so they definitely uh knew each other i believe they went to uh college you know together and uh that's where they met so oh, i must the tv must have been watching me at that moment <laughs> <laughs> <All right. laughs> yeah but uh i know she was definitely having issues with kanye who oh my goodness kanye 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 and I don't know how <laughs> we like fall under the same sign, but oh my goodness, Kanye, she was a hot mess on this show. She was like the mean girl. It was like, what's what's going on, Kanye? Like, what what's what's happening right now? Yeah, because she she spoke her mind. If, if she thought you uh, didn't look good, she would let you know. You know, it's. If she thought that uh, you're stepping, overstepping your boundaries, she tried to kick you out. You know, she she had no fear of, uh, you know, she 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 had a purpose. I put yeah, it that way. She, yeah. I want to say I don't want to say she's high maintenance because I, I mean I, that, that could be that's an easy label mm-hmm. to say she's high maintenance. I just think that. Cause I know at one point she mentioned, cause like at first I'm like, dude, this this chick, this girl is, woo, you know, only a, a only a submissive person <laughs> could be with her, you know, cause she's controlling, demanding, that. Mm-hmm. But then you know, but then she made a, a a good point about how I wouldn't, you know, if I you thought I, if I'm high maintenance, if you thought I'm all about money, 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 whatever, I wouldn't be with you, <laughs> you know. And she so did I'm say that, like, yeah. You know, so I'm just like. That's a fair point, you know. So I was, I'm trying. I was trying to be objective, but mm-hmm. she was still, she was pushing back. You know, here I'm like, all right, Kanye, I'm trying to be objective. I'm right. trying to like you for who you are, but you're not helping. Uh, right. Oh, here's another thing, you're not helping. You know. <laughs> <laughs> but but uh, teach his own, and uh, you know, she likes the the good stuff, and um, you know. As, as a Sagittarius, I get the I'm I'm blunt when I speak. I'm gonna get to the point. I'm not trying to beat around the bush. I do that, but I do it respectfully, and that's mm-hmm. where I think that she lacked. You know, she didn't care if she hurt your feelings or not. It was like I'm gonna say it, and either you deal with it or you don't. But then when somebody comes at her, it was like there was an issue. It's like no, nah, uh, uh-uh. uh. If you gonna dish it, you got to be able to take it, you know, as yeah, she well. Yeah she, yeah, she couldn't yeah, take it. Right, and she did make a comment saying that initially she was more about, you know, the money. She was like, and then, you know, she was like, I realized that that's not the only thing, and I, I bring more to the table as well as you know my partner brings more to the table. So I, I believe as far as reunion time, and maybe after she had some reflection. And, you know, was able to watch herself on this show. <laughs> she, you know, calmed down a little bit. And probably because of that surprise that they shared at the reunion that they, you know, end up having a, I think it was a daughter. So I believe it was a girl. It was a boy. It was a son. Oh, okay. So they had a boy. So. Yeah. yeah. So I, I know that that definitely- Didn't understand the name. Uh, <laughs> but, but I believe it was, it was a boy. Cause I remember he was saying how he always wanted a boy because okay. that was the one where he didn't have because he didn't have a father. Or some or his, oh, his father okay. died when he was when he was really young, mm-hmm. so something like that, right? Was that him? I where he talked about? I think it was him where he talked about he didn't have a father, mm-hmm. or no, was well, father died with cancer or something like that at, a, at an early age, mm-hmm. and uh, so he wanted to have one, and he has one now, and I think that All was right. him, yeah. uh, the story. But but yeah, I mean, like with Kanye, it's. Like I said, at first I was just like, you know, for many of the episodes, I'm just like, dang, girl, come on, get it together, you know, get it together, get it together, get it together. 
Um, but again, to each his own. I mean, there's always someone out there for somebody. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. And um, you know, I didn't want to knock her for for who she was because she stood her ground. She wasn't wishy washy. She mm-hmm. stood her ground as to you know who she was. And I think you know, and and over time, like you said, when you like, if she watched the show, whatever, she realized like, oh, that 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 was kind of wrong. That was kind of wrong. That was kind of wrong. And mm-hmm. and people do grow up, um, but there's still a little bit of of you know stuff in them and, and still so it's yeah. i don't know it was it was interesting to see they all had different different uh thoughts on life love relationships yeah uh, and things like that absolutely she seemed just so angry and i know yeah. a lot of times behind that anger is mostly pain so I'm not sure who may have, you know, possibly hurt her. And it was like just so angry, just lashing out at everybody. That's, that's like, true. And then when someone and then when someone wanted to to speak and express yeah. their feelings, she's like, like Right. Come on, get it over Come on, you know, she was just yeah. like, I don't want to hear it. You know, here we go again. It was mm-hmm. that type where so much judgment. Have, just, yeah, just no no feeling, you know, in the mm-hmm. sense where it's just mm-hmm. just like so like you said, maybe something. That's why I don't want to judge per se because yeah. it could have been something that because so, there's some inside, some internal pain, and mm-hmm. I believe they're they're going through therapy, right? Was that them? That was that the couple that's going through therapy? Like Possibly. The Possibly. Okay. I don't know because um, I didn't write that down in my notes. <laughs> let me, let me <laughs> but possibly. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm looking at the couples now. I believe, yeah, yeah, they're going okay. through therapy because, oh, like, yeah, because they, because of the, <laughs> the, the uh, surprise that was spoken on the, um, on the uh, reunion. They're mm-hmm. they're going through therapy. Yeah, I mean, I I wish them well. I'm glad that she came out and apologized to uh, Tandy. So that definitely uh, shows growth. So I, I, you know, I appreciate that. But uh, ooh, she, she definitely brought the energy, the fire, all of that to the episode. And they, and they all, they all like in the reunion. They all changed their style too. Mm-hmm. Their style, their yeah. hair, hair yeah. color, uh, mm-hmm. just a little, little bit of everything. But yeah. I don't know why I just brought that up. Yeah. <laughs> and then. Who, who you want to talk about next? You want to talk about Ruth or you want to talk about Lebo? <laughs> who, who we going to? It all depends on do you want to incorporate the reunion as well with, with the with, with Yeah, I mean, yeah, we could uh incorporate all of it. So, uh, so let, let's talk let's talk about uh Lebo first. Let's talk about that couple first. Okay. So uh Lebo and Nola, Nola. Yeah. yeah. They're, uh, they were together for like about a year and a half. Um, there's an age difference between them. I think it's like eight Dang. years or something like that. For real? She, yeah, she's in her 20s and he's in his 30s. She's mm-hmm. in her 20s? Yeah. No. Mm-hmm. For real? Yeah. I, I be- what did they talk I, about that? I missed that. I believe, well, they show like the caption when they do the name, they'll show like the age. And I believe yeah. it said that she was like 26 and he was 34. It was yeah, something to that manner or 28. I need, I need to <laughs> I need to figure out how to increase the <laughs> caption size, the text size, because I saw I saw a lot of the text, you know, you know like they're talking, they would translate. No, I don't say translate because they were speaking English. Uh, but, you know, they had that stuff. But yeah, I need to figure out how to increase the, the text size. I, I missed that part. Yeah. Or or better yet, just stay close to the screen, like You're or right. put a little a little circular magnifying glass and, and watch it, watch the show like this. But I, yeah. I missed that part. A lot of them okay. were kind of like in their upper twenties. Some of, most of them, for the most part, were around the same age. Uh, well, she appeared yeah. to be much more mature than him. Yeah. Oh, uh, absolutely. So that's, that's absolutely. why. That's why I was. That's why I was shocked because she, no matter what happened throughout the whole, I don't say season, but throughout the whole series or whatever, I mean, she kept her composure. You know, she kind of mm-hmm. went, went out a little bit, you know, especially her feelings. But she's just so soft spoken. But the words that come out of her mouth are powerful. But she's very yeah. soft spoken. But um, that's why I never thought that she was not to say that in the twenty. Hey, some of you guys think twenty is old. No, I'm, I'm, you know, yeah, she's I'm double her age. Then, but, <laughs> but, um, right. But yeah, I, I think she did. She, 
she had initially wanted to do the trial uh, marriage with Isaac. I believe it was Isaac that she had wanted to uh, go with. Yes, and, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, and they would have been uh, better suited. Like they showed in the reunion how they're like really good friends now, and they talk like all the time. So I think mm-hmm. they would have learned from each other if uh, you know he had chose her back. You know he had mm-hmm. went chose the uh, Kanye, but. Uh, but yeah. Oh wait, did we talk about that? We didn't even talk about Kanye and the, the tech go. But we're here now. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we, we did. did. Oh. We didn't talk about him. We talked about her a little oh, bit. Okay. Remember, we, we kind of talked about her. We okay. didn't go into the. I guess we didn't go too much into the couple. Yeah. But, uh, um, we talked about her and, and did we talk? I don't know if we talked about the news from the reunion. I know you kind of yeah, hinted. Right. Yeah. It. Right. Yeah. That they had the uh, the baby. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, precious they're still, baby. Still they're, they're together. Still, yeah, they are in therapy. They are still mm-hmm. together. Mm-hmm. Um, and um, they're happy, but they're kind of taking it easy, right? Right. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. uh, uh, Nadeko, Nadeko was uh, ended up with a scissor. So, and they had like a really good relationship. They bonded. So, yeah. But as far as uh, Lebo and Nola, so. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, he had cheated in the past and they worked through it, you know, got back together. She she loved that man. <laughs> like through all of his like ups and downs, whatever. She loved him. But he he just you could just tell he just was not ready, like really for a commitment. Cause I believe he truly loved, you know, her too. He just, you know, wasn't ready for a commitment. He just wanted to go out and explore and he found the right one to explore with when it came to Ruth because she was ready for it too and I will say that I mean technically everybody's broken up through this trial marriage it's like okay your your previous relationship has ended now we're starting fresh so I mean you're free to do whatever unless you and your partner have you know set some boundaries or whatever beforehand but you're free you know to do uh to do the whatever <laughs> And then I put too much juice, so now it's like, where the hell is my tequila at? <laughs> where, where is it? I I need more. I call myself putting like a double shot, but then I added ice and too much juice. You are funny. I was gonna pull up some pictures, and I'm still not comfortable. Oh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> 